Dr. Vile. I'm here with greatest the great, greatest gamer. God damn it. With the zero, zero, not just one zero, people, two zeros to show how many zeros he'd be getting when he's going against me. <laughs> oh my fucking God. That's <laughs> why. I am the moose. You know what I mean by moose now? No, Mostly I don't. Mostly our line since educated. I'm not saying I'm the goat. I'm not saying I'm the alpha. I'm saying the moose, man. That's the new thing I have created. And I had made sure the uh, the anthem with them, the acronyms, I mean, made sense. And it surely did. If you guys don't understand it, well, get on a higher level. Did you mean to but, say uh, ac acronyms? Yeah, acronyms. Whatever, dude. That's what the moose was. Mostly out of mind since educated. Since yeah. educated. Come on, man. Yeah, but you guys. It's just... okay. What 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 uh, podcast number is this? Survive cast? Uh, how, is this what fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth? Chill episode. I mean, sorry, season one, episode one. Technically, it would be eleven. But yeah. now we're on season two. People, more oh, missed out season one, which yeah, is unfortunate. Yeah. The last episode, but he'll be he'll be back mid season two on episode one, not mid season of like the episode seasons. But you guys get the idea. I have created the new season. Each 10 episodes is going to be its own season. Actually, it shouldn't be, right? Because we didn't even take a long break. Isn't that like how seasons is? Like, you take a break. Uh, no, you... seasons is just when you decide it's a season. I don't think it has anything to do with breaks. It just all huh. depends. Like, 12 episodes, 24. depends on the format, right? Are we doing by 12 or 24? I mean, look, man, I haven't even uploaded half my bullshit. So, I, I wouldn't... Like, I, my seasons aren't even set in stone yet. <laughs> So I guess so, we are about season two then, if we're being I honest. You know, I would consider the you know what, fuck it, we could consider because the first time we're actually seeing gameplay, as far well on my end at least, instead of just oh whatever. Also, Mar is a bit late on this one. He might not show up, so it might just be a vile GG pot. But speaking of seasons, my doggo, he's uh one year with us. I put I post a photo right here for you guys. A homie has been with us for one year, hopefully for many years, and. uh what else did I wanted to talk about? There's that. Right now um, we're killing time until Mar. Maybe hopefully shows. Oh, that's cool. You can just break through this. But yeah, we're hopefully gonna be able to play some games too because we think pal, but we can't do that without Mar because I want to help Mar's world. I don't really give a shit about anything else. But um, yeah, my doggo Polly. Mar has a doggo too. I don't know when his one year is, but I know it's gonna be this year for sure. We'll find that out when he joins. I know you don't have any pets. Not anymore. Not anymore. Sorry. But. I mean, they weren't even mine, but that's a sad point. Um, I feel like I had a follow up of that. As you guys know, if you guys been following me, you guys already know those squad videos. The those squad actually squad videos is gonna be new to you guys. Um, I still it's it's a very long game, so I had to really edit down the action part because other than that, the game is so somewhat boring. It's only fun for me because I actually enjoyed the sound of the footsteps. You're the one that's playing, that. huh? Plus, you're the one that's playing, so... Yeah, I guess I'm the one that's playing. The game's only fun if you're the one that's playing, Eggs. obviously. But then it gets boring in case you gotta hike, because there's no one with a vehicle around you, so it's it's very, unfortunately, realistic. I like it that way. A lot of um, Radio Now videos. As far as different content, this Thursday, I'm gonna get three games. I'm hoping that it will be interesting. One of them is Content Warning. I know that game's been popping off. I have a Man, goddamn uh, lethal company. Yeah, we need to get that out the way. Shit. Oh yeah, as you guys already know, lethal company might be a thing. Uh, we'll see. I didn't realize it was made by a fairy, so if I knew that, I wouldn't have bought it. But that's besides the point. What's going on with Sony? What's going on with you, greatest? Oh, we'll, we'll get to that one. Like I said, it's just a preload, uh, you guys. Like I said, till we win any more. But what was one of the things I wanted to ask you? Oh yes, I got fucking. Uh... This dude into goddamn blend s. How you like him blend s? And also the, to oh, watch yeah. the Spikes family. Let's get your thoughts oh, first on the Spikes family. Maybe. I totally forgot that what? blew my uh, blew out of my head on the on the Spy X family movie. I forgot that I watched it. What? <laughs> that movie was legendary. All right, I, I, it's gonna get me. It was a good starter to. Oh, I should probably watch the anime. I'm, you didn't I haven't watch watched the anime, that. you guys. Can you believe that? You just went in raw. <sighs> That's how I always do it, man. That's what I did with. Uh, Oh boy, what was that one? Uh, uh, no, it was Demon Slayer. I did watch the show before I watched the movie. There was another anime out there. I watched the movie first and watched the anime because it's like it's like it's like a big preview of what you're about to get yourself into once you get into those seasons. 
I was told by someone that also watched Spy X Family that the uh, wife didn't know that they were spies. I mean, he was a spy. Yeah. But then during the anime, I guess it was after season between season one, one and three, two. I don't know. Point of being is it was a good anime. Highly enjoy it. Highly recommend watching it. Spy X Family is like the anime of the century right now. Like it is popular. I, I was going to be disappointed. I'm not going to lie. I had watched it in GDX experience, so like it was pretty dope. What the hell's GDX experience? I wanted to ask about that. Like, what's that mean, bro? Like, we already had IMAX. I barely kind of know what that means sometimes. You think I would for such a snob that I am? Not to find out what the heck GDX means. Uh, where did I type that in, man? Oh, no, I had to Google it. All right, guys, hold on. Give me a minute here. All I know is that they didn't increase the prices of the tickets, thank God. Oh, but GDX means hello mar what does it mean good rich quality theater uh what's the difference what's, what it's supposed to provide the, difference, the screen is bigger and the, the sound effects is a little different i forgot what the sound i think i kind of had that because i i said they were they had they actually did a really good job of mimicking fire uh, when i wasn't did you have that too when there was a fire scene and i was like oh that sounds pretty good i think yeah yeah GD yeah, so I think that's just by default. I think all theaters are like that. They have to appeal since so many people don't go to theaters. <gasps> oh, that is a good combo too, actually. Oh, but, shit. Uh, other than the audio, I mean, it, it's just a bigger screen. That's where they really come. It's a 70 inch. I think it was 70 wide and something higher. I forgot what the ex exact measurements was. Well, are we making movie theaters? Uh, no, I was just, we were just talking about the Spy X family movie theater, about my movie experience with it. Oh. You watched it? Nope. Not yet. The correction is not that I don't care for it, it's that I have so much of a fucking backlog when it comes exactly. to anime. Besides, that's an anime you should watch with his daughter, too. That's that's, that's I watched... the anime. See, I already know, bro. Look at you. Family, family. I forgot it was a family, family movie. But you see, my I watched a movie before I've been watching the anime, but now I gotta watch the anime. Now it's like a good sponsorship. I was selling uh, Greatest Gamer. Dude, I've always heard good things about Spy Family, so that's not really surprising me. Right, exactly. No, dude, I love it. Dude, I, to me, it's one of my favorite anime of all time already. Yeah. We were just having conversations that we you know that you probably would, but like, not no. too much. Right. I mean, it, it, he added to the Spy X one, so that's good. Oh, and the last one, what did you like about Blend S so far? Oh, you Venice time. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. You like your own? Ten, ten hoes on? <laughs> How do you like seeing the original ten hoes? Before anything, I do want to mention, I forgot about C2E2. C2E2 mm -hmm. happened, and I mm -hmm. saw it on Instagram Reels where the, these, the, these nerds, Fallout fans, mm -hmm. one of the guy proposed with the other person, so I was like, that's yeah. pretty nice, I guess. Oh, that's cool. Uh, I saw someone, uh, my friend went, she goes every year, uh, stuff the straw bunny in case you guys didn't know, she's a Funko creator and whatnot. She had, I guess, fun too with the photos I could tell. Someone was walking around with like the uh, uh, Doctor Who box machine, I forgot what you called it, I think it was the TARDIS. I wish I was there this year, it seems like a lot of fun, it seems like there was two people with like the Mario Kart vehicles oh, that's, oh that's, that sounds like a oh you yeah. know what mario kart and then it was Luigi. deadpool like on a little uh he was on a little kid scooter that was pink it was funny man deadpools people who who cosplay as deadpool usually never fails really it's legendary i mean it's, 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 it's kind of hard to fuck up with deadpool well disney really you know they could easily fuck it up they didn't even want to make the deadpool movie but yeah well, jumping to make sure century fox already fucked it up we got our first mission done out the way, but I'm playing, you know, something, you know, finally got this, I like, oh, I could, you know, play a game while we do something, I gotta pick an easy game, I'm playing that new funny game where you break stuff, and the brick, and it's all pixely, but, uh, what was the other topic, I guess, see, we, we'll get the prelude out the way already, because now Mars here. Yes, but, yes. But, okay, so you talk about your doggy, I talk about Blenders, and then, oh, I guess we'll add that to the topic about theaters, oh, we, we did talk, did we talk about Ubisoft's booty water at Star Wars game, or no, I forgot, mm -hmm. some of them, them, we did, right? Oh, uh, we talked about the first one for the last time. Yeah, yeah. The, their, uh, what's it called? Outlaw? Yeah, we talked about it, right? What? Yeah, we talked about the, what is it, $110 okay. fucking oh, yeah. version of the game. Yeah, and then we need to, I know for sure, we didn't talk about it too much, but we definitely talked about the whole, they're destroying our games, don't let them. Like, I think we talked about that a bit more. Then the plot, the whole Tarkov situation, especially someone as a Tarkov player, that's what we're going to be doing. Then, oh, um, uh... I mean, there's some things about all games, what we expect and stuff. Uh, if you want to go to the checkpoint, like I said, because I was skimming over our stuff to see what we should re bring up again. And one of the things that you had, that's why, yeah, he brought it up earlier. Because, like, oh, you didn't talk about this, but yours was the, the, it's almost near at the top. And I think you're talking about, like, all, like, we talked about it a bit, but we didn't do it. Oh, yeah, your idea of good DLC. I did, I remember I did that, so I remember that. But it's, 
we did about bland AAA make their own studios. Okay, no, actually, never mind. I think we did talk. Okay, so we talked about that. Yeah, no, oh, yeah, no, you were talking about franchises oh. being slept on and all that other whatnot. But that, that could be saved again. That's your bookmark. Are you going to talk about that Walmart? $1 games oh, okay, at Walmart? Yeah, so, okay, that's our preload a bit. Oh, I guess what's not, oh, now I remember, it was the stupid tier list thing, because like I said, these aren't tier related. Do, do, do we, are we going to talk about the stupid chicken oh, shit? Do I do want to talk about the chicken shit, come on, man. Switch over screens for this I, one, I, so. Uh... Okay, ladies and gentlemen, my favorite YouTuber of the year, um, Meat Cannon, or K Papa Meats, he went around his way to try out every chicken sandwich place there is. I watched it today, this morning. Um... His list was pretty solid. The only issue I have is that Winnie's is underneath McDonald's with Burger King. So if this was my list, right? Number one is Kane's. Number two would be Popeye's. Number three would be Wendy's. Wait, no, my bad. Chick-fil-A? What was that right? What? Wait. Don't take too long on this. Yeah, yeah. Okay, my bad, my bad. Okay, uh, number three would be Wendy's. Number four would be Chick-fil-A. Number five would be uh, McDonald's. Number... Six could be Burger King, but that's all I could really rate because I never had chicken sandwiches from Sonic or Whataburger or KFC or that Zebby's. Yeah. But what they tell you, they didn't even taste Zebby's. They took a bite of it and they just threw it out. You're in text. <laughs> you, you're going to read it? I would actually elaborate it on the Kane's has no taste. If anyone says Kane's has zero fucking taste, the only thing that they have over there is their sauce. Without the sauce, that chicken is bland as fuck. Dude, Lower in the tier list. Popeyes? No, now here's the funny part about Popeyes. I rock at Popeyes, but I still have problems with Popeyes because a lot of the time when you go to a Popeyes, they fucking overheat their shit like they fucking do. crazy. We get overcooked fucking chicken, but I'm not gonna lie, they're fucking yeah. spicy. Okay. Don't. That's the reason why I still put them up high in the tier list. Now, the ones that shouldn't even be in the tier list, in my point of view, Burger King, because no one really goes there. McDonald's because that's 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 rat food right there. That's not even uh, actual chicken. I don't even know why people back. put it on the list. And then what what else is on the list? That last one that they had the list. The West Coast thing, I think that's Whatever. what Mar said. He lives in the southern states, I'm pretty sure. Well, is that all? I will get mine quick over too. Well, you don't I'm have really a really opinion? Actually... Got me some stir frying, oh, no. fucking took a shower and shit. That's why I ended up fucking being late over here. But, I, I can't let this slide though. You t- you telling me you don't like McDonald's? Bro, it's been pretty weak. That's not it. Exactly. That's not real chicken. Nah. Man. Real big nuggets, and I immediately tasted the difference. I'm like, yeah, nah, bro. Me and Gamer about that KFC. See, I'll bring that know, up because I'm the KFC food. expert here. Honestly, we're not white. <laughs> Lit biscuit? Oh <laughs> hell no. Fire. Because the gaming, because the gaming industry was fucking up. Um, don't you remember that KFC? Our- let let Mar go off because you know he's definitely you know. Oh okay, like just. Because- I say these fast food restaurants. Oh my god, dude, these restaurants, not restaurants. See, that's like that's the key. <laughs> no, thing. Money is. no, and here, all right, all right, like I said, let Mark keep going. He's, oh, I have a gun. You know what? You know what? Go, go, go right ahead. Yeah, I, I've right, already right, said right. what I said. You know, honestly, if you really want to go check a place, go exactly, to a yes. local place that yes. actually yes. makes chicken. Don't go to any yes. of these fucking that, spots. That, he, so he said my message that I wanted to add, leave at the end. Like there you go. Like you're comparing fast food restaurants to actual places that can like make. It's like oh yeah, like me. A good example. I fucking. Even these Mexican places, you guys, yeah, people are like, oh, they're, they're good. But as a real Mexican, I'm like, yo, this shit is trash. Like, dude, even at the place I work at, like, I recommend the combination, our tortas, maybe our burritos, this. But, like, our regular steak tacos, garbage. Our chicken tacos, average. Like, but that's about it. And that's me, like, because my mom makes the most god-tier steak fucking tacos ever, bro. When you get some authentic, at- nothing touches that shit. You ain't gonna touch some shit made with love and care, bro. Fuck out of here with that. So that's the whole thing, like, oh, this is in relative to each other. That's what this list is. Like, ain't no one gonna sit here and say, oh, KFC, Kane's, Chicken, Popeyes is better than mom's cooking. Fuck no. Miss me with that shit, bro. If if Mars grandmother or something, you know, whatever, old school, oh, I'll make you some food, honey. Like, oh, shit, she said, honey, I already know that shit's gonna be Mars, bro. <laughs> know what I'm saying? That honey at them restaurants are saying, uh, a very nah. bland thank you from an under underpaid-ass worker, bro. They ain't got that secret ingredient, man. That, the secret ingredient is love. <laughs> Anyways, my... I think I like Kane's intro because I like they don't really say it, but they like, they say, "Do you want that chicken?" And, you know, and so here's how my list would be. <laughs> Believe it or not, I would still have Chick Kane's, Chick Fil A, Popeyes would be up there, but I don't know why I put KFC solo. But the thing is, KFC, like how Mar mentioned, it it actually sucks balls in some locations, and they don't care as much as Popeyes. And for sure, Popeyes seasoning is better than KFC, but the chicken skin is much better on KFC. But here's the funny thing about that: it used to be better. The reason I would personally put KFC number one, if you go to Japanese KFC. 
whole nother fucking ball game or original original kfc like this whole video guys check that out i'll probably link it below but the even the person who gave a right for the the crispy chicken shit he went to a recent ish one and he's like oh this shit ain't right he literally went to the back of the restaurant and sold up people like no this is how you make this shit and i was like wait damn bro because that's the main thing like what, what's the best part oh the fucking skin of the kfc chicken like that's the main reason i like it and like yeah no everything you said is pretty bars like you know i just i'm, over, I'm more of a kfc guy over popeyes but at the end of the day they're kind of the same shit you know for depending on much of an enthusiast for chicken you are i'm very like I really like chicken, but I'm like super into it. Whereas Chick Fil A and Canes, their chicken is definitely not as good as Popeyes or KFC. But what really kills it is like their sauce. Like I'm gonna keep it real. I don't know the difference between Canes and Chick Fil A because they have the same chicken tender shit. And yeah, they're like pretty bland. I like the tenders, right? Like they taste fine to me. But like without the sauce, it's like bro, what, what are you doing? And they don't flavor this shit like KFC or Popeyes. So I would have to be like KFC, Popeyes, uh, probably Chick Fil A over Canes because I like the Chick Fil A sauce. Burger King's chicken burgers, they're very mid, mid. They're they're, they're just kind of there. McDonald's, I don't know why this is on the list either. Sonic, I can't say. Whataburger ask. has good burgers. I don't know if they're good for you. So having Whataburger low on the list is not like as a diss. I just wouldn't consider it like, yeah, no, it's Whataburger like greasy. Like it's just like, okay, it's just some, you know, like, not when it's even junk food, but it's just like, oh, you know, some slop, but like not even bad slop. You know what I'm saying? Better for that's where I would, that's my whole thing with the list. Chicken. Outside of like, so you just go get some real shit or, you know, fuck it, make it yourself, but I ain't no one that. Walmart chicken? Okay, you know what, Loki? Some you know what? I'm a cap. I don't know. Empire. I don't know much about Walmart chicken. Walmart chicken. It really depends. Like, you know what's actually better than somebody? Maybe you guys can attest. You know those chickens that they have on the rotisseries or some bullshit, like your Walmart or your Jewel or some shit. Like, yo, that shit is actually fucking. That's 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 good chicken. Because guess what? That chicken was clean and the whole chicken is there. And then fuck with it and you do it yourself. See, look at that. See, that's already better. That's a better tier list because they name stuff the fucking chicken with no shit or anything. Because like they have to have that shit ready, bro. That shit's actually Loki good. That shit. And it's cheaper. So there you go. Tier list. Be like, oh, that all these Walmart chicken they, that they have on the little fucking rotisserie shit. But like I said, you know, obviously comparing, you know, your local eatery or something that actually has it right. And they know where the shit is compared to just bucket mass manufacture it, put it all frozen. As Wendy says, oh, you know, fresh, never frozen. That's a little bullshit. Everything has to be frozen. What are you talking about? I don't know why Wendy says that shit. Wendy's chicken burgers are probably better than Burger King, but that's not saying too much. You know, that's my list, right? Like I said, I can't say Sonic, but maybe Sonic's below Whataburger? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. We might have to do a... a we might have to do... We might have to do a video yeah, later. No. That's my whole thoughts on that shit, but I, I agree with it. I wouldn't mind that. I'll that video where we actually go to all these hot stocks to try out the, the chicken just to see. We, I mean, to make it cheaper, we, we just order it plain and then we cut it in half so we don't have to oh, keep... Smart. You know, <laughs> it'll be too. It'll be too expensive. For our empire. budgets, mm -mm. Limp Biscuit is a band. <laughs> yeah, I know about Limp Biscuit. Keeping the it band. real. Sorry about that. You guys chat was saying some shit. Uh, but I, when you said Limp Biscuit, I know it comes from like a meme originally. That's like, oh god, because most people don't know. A biscuits? Eh, whatever. If if you don't, I don't know, like you know the, uh, I guess look it up. I know what you, I know what you're talking yeah. about. But, and, I, but I'm just saying like prelude, right? So I can you know make my bookmark for Wisecut. Yes, perfect. 